That's why it's like, we're gonna call this a hood interview because it's a hood interview because right. we still have nothing set up yet. We got the janky light. I haven't had an adult beverage. I'm drinking, water. I'm still That's hydrating. That's Starbucks water though. The good exactly. news is it's 20 bucks and it tastes like water. Exactly. Yeah. Let me tell you right now, the electrolytes in this are through the roof, guys. <laughs> uh, High Valley, I wanna say, it wasn't last year, but two years ago that you were here? Yeah. Or what, two years ago. Uh, when Curtis kissed the ground when he got out of the van and kissed the concrete, did you hear about that? No, oh, it, actually, I saw online. a picture. Online. I saw yeah. a picture, but I didn't hear the story. You got tested for 20 different diseases after. Uh, it was clean. Turns out I didn't have them all. Yeah. <laughs> Half the checklist, though. Half yeah. the checklist. Oh, yeah. why, why was that? Uh, I just, somebody said, uh, you gotta kiss the ground when you get to Vegas. I, I don't know. I just, it felt like the right thing to do. You know? I feel you. Do you Vegas remember the first like, time? Have you, you ever had a younger yeah. brother? Oh, yeah. Do you have a younger oh. brother? That's I do, and it's embarrassing. Okay. <laughs> I, uh, you're in Vegas again this time. You guys have been back a, a handful of times. Yeah, we pretty since. much live here now, honestly. Well, when are you going to buy a house? I don't know, man. I like the hotel so much. I think we'll just keep staying. And I'm a renter. Like, I'm not I'm not going to buy in Las Vegas. I'm going to rent. Because when the money runs out, there's no commitments. You just run. <laughs> I, have, I have a feeling that's my wife's view on marriage, too, but it's fine. <laughs> but what, what does it mean? Listen, you, you've done Stoney's Robin Country in town before you guys played there. We played a few times in this town, but never had a big festival. Never opening for opening for opening for here at church, and it's going to be unbelievable. You know, hey, you could add a hundred openings. You're still opening for the chief tonight. <laughs> yes, that's sir. right. That's right. Uh, what does it mean to be? I mean, you guys have had success, right? But you're still a part of a festival like this where guys like Eric Church, who have been around forever, massive hits, tons of number ones. You guys are on the verge of a massive hit on the radio right now. How does it feel to be involved in the mix of this? Man, our goal, honestly, we get out there, we got 30 minutes, right? And some people are there to see us. A lot of people, let's be honest, are there to see Eric Church and get a sunburn for six hours before he hits the stage. And our job is to make High Valley fans out of those people. So we, we try our hardest. We were just out with Tim and Faith opening for them, and every night it's the same thing. It's yeah. like, you've got 30 minutes to convince these people to love your music or not. And thankfully it's working. We like the challenge. We love the challenge. It's a hell of a challenge, Tim and Faith there at church. Because you know what comes next. Yeah. They're open for you. <laughs> oh, man. Wow, that's step number two. So, let's take a look into my crystal water glass and tell the future of the gentleman of High Valley. Okay. What do you say? You're going to kick ass tonight. All right. I love it. <laughs> a whole bunch of new streams and a whole bunch of new downloads. What about Instagram followers? Can you see that on there? Through the roof. Oh. Okay. oh. You're married? Yeah. Stay out of the DMs tonight. Okay. That's okay. not a good look tonight. Okay. No, I'm kidding. Right. Gentlemen, Sorry. High Valley, thank you so much for coming to Vegas. Enjoy your time at Route 91. And of course, we love you at 95.5 The Bulls. So thank you guys out. so much. Thank you. Boom. Let's snap a pic and I'll send you out.